all right hello you guys hi everyone thank you for watching my channel she's got the gift okay i'm back with the reading for my bull my earth sign taurus taurus sun moon rising and venus hi taurus i've been trying to deliver you some messages okay before we jump into your reading tours, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for me, please. I truly appreciate you. I love you guys. Don't forget that my messages are fluid in general, okay? So when it's pop, when it pops up, you see it, click on it because it's for you. Take this for you and leave the rest. If it doesn't resonate, it's okay. Leave it for someone else. Just continue to hit that subscribe button and that bell so you will know every time that I upload a video, okay, Taurus? With no further ado, let's jump into this reading for you. Spirit, white light, holy angels. I call upon you, Spirit, to protect me, Archangel Michael. To guide me. Any bad juju sent to, to Taurus, any foul play being sent towards Taurus way without the acknowledgement, we send it back zero fold. We don't care what goes on with nobody. Just don't send that bad juju over here to us. Please give us some resonating, healing, utilizing messages for the Taurus. Spirit, Taurus, Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus sign. We're truly grateful. Thank you for utilizing me as a vessel. What's going on with the Taurus, Spirit? We're going to get you a wisdom, an oracle, and then we're going to tap into the tarot for you, okay? Oh, okay. That was like pretty straight to the cut. Taurus, you got 30 rigged, and then you have, oof, 34 trapped. 33 could be significant. Somebody could be 33. I feel like somebody feel like they stuck, too. Um, you could be seeing crows. Taurus, I feel like uh, someone is speaking to you that that's passed on, a loved one that's passed on is trying to get your attention. Um, it's something about... You know, when you go to the beach and then all those rocks that stacked up, some, someone goes there and I think, I feel like that's one of you guys' happy places and someone is telling you to go there. And maybe you could get out of this, this, this entrapment feeling, you feeling stuck for some reason. It could be a job. I don't know what that's about. Hmm. Thank you, Spirit. We're truly grateful. Get your oracle. We're gonna wait for that. Okay. Thank you, spirit. What's going on for the Taurus? Taurus sun, moon rising, and Venus sun. Taurus, if you feel like, if you've been feeling like lately your energy has been drained, or you you wake up in the morning and you feel slumped, that's not your energy. That's someone else's energy. It could be an air sign, but that's someone else's energy, okay, Taurus? So get up, tell yourself, this is not my feelings. I'm happy. Thank you, Spirit. Thank you, Father God, and continue your day, okay? Don't let nobody bring you down, Taurus. What's going on with the Taurus, Spirit? We're truly grateful. You got a match out here. Give me the outcome for Taurus. And then 
will begin. Give me the outcome for Taurus Spirit. Truly grateful. The bottom of the deck. Overall energy. Ten of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, and the Nine of Swords. Okay, your overall. Your outcome is the Moon and the Six of Wands in reverse. Uh, Taurus, here's the deal. You have the Five of Pentacles here, the Magician, and the Queen of Wands. This is why you feeling stuck. Some someone, so someone left you out in the cold, or this could be you that left someone out. I don't even feel like necessarily you left them out in the cold. It's just like someone feel like you you turned your back on them, and they didn't expect for you to turn your back on them. But at the same time, someone was being man manipulative, so you knew this is what you had to do. It's to step into your power and own shit and be who you are. Um, be your authentic self. Second row, you have the two of swords, you have the lovers, and you have the nine of cups and reverse. Someone was being manipulative about a third party situation that they put you in. Or I feel like towards someone bring someone around you saying that they're friends, saying that they're a friend, saying that they're a cousin, an uncle, an auntie. But in reality, someone is sleeping with someone with the nine of cups here in reverse. But that's all it is. It's like it's no loving there. It's just like sex with queen of wands, nine of cups in reverse to the king of wands right here. Someone has this, this, this passion for someone someone has so much chemistry for you that it's unbearable so even if there was dealing with someone else they're going to always double back to you with the page of cups here the fool and the king of wands um they're going to tell you this i feel like they're going to say okay hey i did this someone is getting ready thank you spirit someone is getting ready to lay everything out there on the line hey taurus yes there's a possibility taurus i'm just i have to put this out there that someone goes both ways here definitely i see that here with the lovers here someone has someone is dealing with three different energies here my lover's card for me is uh, my bisexual card. The both the best, the, you can have the both the best worlds, okay, whenever I see this card come out. So this is where I'm getting this from. But somebody sees that um, you are the rider. Like, if, if, you, if you understand what I'm trying to say, um, if they just sit you down and tell you what it is, if they take this leap of faith, okay, I'm going to go tell Taurus that deep down inside, yes, I dealt with a man before. Deep down inside, uh, yes, one, one person cannot satisfy me. So this is what it is, Taurus. They feel like you're going to accept it. And you so down to earth, Taurus, and you such a rider. I feel like if someone just come on and be honest with you, then, hey, that's just what the fuck you get. Okay, now what? You could be, it could be an a Aries that's getting ready to come to you. It could be a um, mm, fire sign. It's a fire sign. Someone is dealing with a Leo here. It could be Sagittarius or Aries, but I'm picking up strong Leo here. It could be a Scorpio you could be dealing with too. But this is the thing, uh, Taurus. Your outcome, your, your, um, oh, wait. Your outcome is the moon and then the six of wands in reverse. So when this person do get ready to step to you with this bullshit, okay, because the six of wands here is in reverse with the moon, I feel like 
they're going to come to you correct, but they're not fully telling you everything. So they're going to come and tell you how much love they got for you and how much feelings they got for you. But they're not going to tell you that, hey, I'm dealing with someone else too, or I have the same feelings that I have for someone else. I have the same feelings for you. The feelings are mutual. I like you for this one thing, but they like somebody else for another thing. This is how I'm feeling right now. And they're going to express that to you. Hey, Taurus, I was immature at the time, but I'm not anymore. You either take me for who I am or don't take me at all. So this is what this person is getting ready to tell you, Taurus. They're on their way to you right now. Um, this person has a scar on their left knee. This person is, uh, is good at communicating. This person has the, the gift for gab. Like the, this, the, the person know how to talk. The person is sweet talks you a lot. Um, but I know, I feel like you like it. With the king of wands here and the queen of wands, um, you guys like to experiment in the bedroom. Someone likes to experiment. Someone likes to bring other people in. Um... And the other person is okay with that, but I feel like they haven't expressed that to you that someone wants to bring someone into bed with you. Someone wants you for one thing and someone wants somebody else for another thing. And now they're coming to you saying that I want to put this all together and see what we get out of it. Someone has blonde hair. Someone has reddish, like on a darker side, reddish hair. What's this fool for the Taurus? Clarify the fool for the Taurus spirit. Someone wants to have a threesome with you. Hmm. It could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. The fool. Clarified by the hermit. So somebody went in and was thinking about this, and that's what they came up with. I might as well go ahead and be honest with the tours. Mm -hmm. Two of Pentacles in reverse. I no longer want to juggle and hide this from you. I'm going to come to you and talk to you. What's the Five of Pentacles for the Taurus? Clarify the Five of Pentacles for the Taurus. My deck in reverse. Yes, it is. No, it ain't. Okay. Uh, clarifying the Five of Pentacles in reverse. You got the star. I mean, Five of Pentacles upright, you got the star and reverse. Two of Swords in reverse. Uh, two, two, two could be significant. You got the Two of Swords out here. Two of Swords out here twice with the Two of Pentacles. Two, two, two. I feel like you're about to see that. Because someone really, someone is coming towards you. You are who they want, but right smack dead in the middle is the lovers. When you're dealing with someone like this, this is a promiscuous person. So no matter what you do, no matter how good you suck it, no matter how good you throw it back, no matter how how good you stick it to her, it's never it's never going to be enough. This is a person that likes to have several people. This is a person um, that that has clout, that has fame. So everybody is throwing themselves at this person, Taurus, and this is what you need to know. Clarify the lovers. Thank you for your time, you guys. I love y'all. I'm going to let y'all go right now. Clarify the lovers for the Taurus. Clarify the lovers for the Taurus spirit. I definitely feel like it's love in this situation, but it ain't the love that that you're looking for. Taurus, you're a fixed sign. You're not... Um, if a person is hiding something from you, that's a fuck up automatically. You get what I'm saying? But if a person come to you and talk to you... Little do they know you're going to be willing to try whatever they want to try. So this this is what this person is getting ready to do. So prepare yourself for that. Someone is coming in to tell you, hey, yeah, I'm promiscuous. Basically, I don't want to say they a hoe, but I, I Taurus, you do it better. But this one thing you do, I want to try it with you. But I want to bring somebody else in the bag because they do something good, too. I want the best of both worlds. Hmm. 
clarifying the lovers you got the six of cups in reverse so this is not somebody that you've been dealing with for a long time so that's here that's the thing that's what you need to know this is not somebody that you've been dealing with for a very long time this could be somebody you've been dealing with for six months the past six weeks you know it, it could even be six years but i just feel like this is not nobody from the past i feel like this is somebody that you're trying to get to know and they're not telling you the full story they're not being completely up like, you know, they're not being completely honest with you up front because your outcome is the moon here and the six of wands in reverse. They're not going to be, they're not who you think they are, okay? They're they're portraying themselves to be somebody else right now. And I feel like they're down in their happiness because they don't know how you really feel about the situation. So they're getting ready to come and talk to you about it. Uh-huh, and I'm going to leave it there. Let's get you an oracle and I'm going to let y'all go. Thank you guys for your time. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for me, okay? Car down. Okay. Towards you, towards you got three cars that fell. The first one is step out of your comfort zone, North Note, because someone is getting ready to come and tell you something, and I think you're going to go along with it. That's just how I feel. Balance spirit. Balance spirit. Spirit. Ugh. Balance spirituality and practicality, okay? You guys know I trip over my words a lot. Don't let pride get in your way, full moon and Leo. So if this something that you okay with, shit, go with it. Taurus, that's what I have for you, okay? Until next time, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, stay blessed and prayed up out here because it's a cold world, Taurus. Cold, cold, cold world. Until next time, bye, Taurus.